exactly what what we wanted. I mean, because I did I did the hair and I did the makeup. I mean, like you know, I do the You're look. The guy. You're right. So basically, what I wanted is an ombre of techniques and an ombre of pinks. Uh, if you look at the collection, you can understand why because it's the whole thing of juxtapositioning the hard and soft. And pinks is normally associated with girly girls. But if you look at these colors, strong women need to have guts to wear these colors. And I took all these colors because um, I just didn't want one color because the, you're not wearing one outfit. There is, there is a collection. So I want a collection of nails too. And I'm trying to bring back, I'm really very over dark nail colors because I think Australia is the, the last bastion in the whole world that's still hanging on to dark colors. So embrace light colors, embrace pink, and also do not match your fingernails to your toes. That is so 70s, like, you know, oh gosh. So have a bit of fun. Look at nail polish as jewelry, as accessories, and have fun. If you don't like it, you can always wipe it off. And I've always worked with Zoya with all my shows, both locally and internationally. I like their ethics. I like the color palettes. And bloody hell, they're just easy to work with, you know.